Excuse me, your son isn't letting my daughter have a turn on the slide. Oh. Okay. So are you gonna do anything? Or? I say we see how this thing plays out. I mean, after four days of rain, I'm not gonna drag my kid inside. Oh, I know. It's like Lord of the Flies in the house. <laughs> but you're in charge of him, right? Oh, uh, we don't like to lean too heavily on those kinds of traditional structures. Okay, so, um, so, so your son is, like, not letting my daughter go down the slide. I totally get it, and yeah. I can see this is important to you. Mm -hmm. So, why don't you just go talk to him? Act, um, yeah, actually, I, I did. And he said that crying is a choice she's making. Oh, she was crying? Yeah, she was, she was crying. Oh, I see that you have um, this parenting style, which I totally respect. But my daughter's unhappy. And she can't ever be unhappy? Well, I'm sure that you'll agree that our job as parents is to make sure that our kids are safe, healthy, well-dressed, and never ever unhappy. Yeah. But, you know, someday your daughter probably is going to be unhappy, so. Oh yes, when she's a grown-up, she will be relentlessly unhappy, just like the rest of us, and that's fine, that's normal. But I'm talking about now. But maybe she'll thrive if she's had some practice being unhappy. So is that your son's job, to help my daughter practice being unhappy? Well, we all play our cosmic roles. I mean, it might seem like tension right now, but I promise you this is like a gift. So I guess we should thank him for his service? Well. I mean, I think that's a little unnecessary, but, I mean, you're welcome. Sierra? Let's go. I'll buy you a beanie boo. What are the big ones? So she can put it on her shelf next to her participation trophy. <sighs> like mother, like son.